Well, hello. This is the Saturday wrap for Saturday the 17th? Yeah, 17th of October 2020. Uh, it's my usual look back on the past week. Um, tech beer. Uh, the beer of the day is pretty fly, or super fly as I prefer to call it, for a magpie by Bradley Tutlow in an oversized Bradley Tutlow glass, a pint glass. Anyway, that is really good if you can get hold of it. Luckily, live close to where it is. So it's a look back on beer and tech and weather and politics and lockdown. So let's get straight into the word or the phrase of the week. And the word of the week it is a word, not a phrase. Well, sort of is break. We are having a circuit break. Well, actually, we're not. We can't be seen in Wales to do the same as other people. So we are having a fire break. Yeah. And it's mentioned probably be better to have a tea break. These are these P-Town boys. Anyway, um, uh, uh, so I was hoping to be away this weekend. I should be in Exeter. Um, I have rescheduled them um, for the 13th of November, which is a Friday, so nothing can possibly go wrong there. Plus the fact I had an extra two pound back. I've also rebooked a travel lodge um, booking and that you have to pay an extra five pounds to uh, change that. So that's 10 pounds already and I haven't even stayed there yet. Um, our figures are going up. We've been in lockdown in Caerphilly for the last is it five weeks or so. I don't think these are going to work. They are certainly not the inclination from a lot of people to actually remain locked down. Three councils, I think it was Merthyr, RCT and Bridgend, complaining about certain people are just not interested and ignoring the rules. Sadly, I'm a law obeyer, but it is annoying. Anyway, so that's a little bit of politics. Um, I'm sure I'll come back to it. Anyway, uh, Windows 2004. Well, I thought I'd fixed it, but I didn't fix it. Um, and I am learning a lot of things about Microsoft and laptops and such like. Anyway, um, purchased a new Dell laptop, which arrived on Tuesday. Um, DPD, I think, did it. Or was it DHL? I can't remember. They were good. They sent me a text. They were in their slot. Um, however, have been having similar, if not the same, issues with the Dell. And I think I've sorted them. So I might have two laptops. Always good to have a backup. And this one is a lot faster. Actually, I'm using it now, so I've installed the software and it's working, but I need to have a look at Hypervisor. Anyway, um, I've been out in the garden. It's been a strange week. It rained a bit. Um, uh, Thursday and Friday, really hot in the office. Thursday, it was 27. There wasn't a cloud in the sky. And the sun was out and there was not a lot of wind and it was Indian October-ish. Am I allowed to say that? Probably not. So out in the garden, um, my summer onions had arrived, so I did three pots worth. And in the week, I think it was Thursday, I went to um, B&Q, got 100 litres more of compost, and I will probably be after this doing some more planting ready for next year. Let's hope 2021 is a better year. Also on the tech front, I mean, I know there was the Apple announcements and there are four iPhone 12s and such like, and the cameras look really, really good. However, they are all first generation 5G chips in them, which First generation tend to be not as good as they could be and tend to be more power hungry. Um, so I'm going to hold off. 
Although I still have a hankering after the Pixel 4a 5G. I just reviewed this week. I don't know if it's actually out this week, but it's far too early. Um, so back to Apple. Um, TV OS 14.0.2 slipped out. Although this talk that it shouldn't have slipped out and it should have been pulled, I don't know. I really don't. Um, hardware is good. Software, generally speaking, especially this year, has been poor. Doesn't matter who it comes from. And on Sunday, on Sunday, I went through 3,500 unique beers on Untapped. I'm quite proud of that. So I'm going to print to app. 3,500. That's since... Um, 2012 it was my new year's resolution and um, okay so october i don't know what i'll aim for next year given the lockdown possibly not a great deal let's say i don't know now oh, let's go for 4000 500 unique beers that's from now from now not for uh, yeah, we need to get out of lockdown. Anyway, um, I'm talking about software, text expander. Text expander is one of the things that doesn't work on the new laptop. Uh, it causes the same problem, and I think it's a .NET issue, so short keys light and typeinator on the, um, on the Mac. Hmm. Counted for that. Um, right, okay, so I need to get that sorted out. Um, and as I said, this week, politics. Um, we could be in complete lockdown in Wales as from next Friday, which won't be a great deal of difference apart from the fact mm, pubs will be closed. Despite the fact that pubs aren't the issue or certain pubs aren't the issue. Especially around here, Caffili Council did a map in the week of the hotspot areas, despite the fact that the whole county is a hotspot, and the figures are going up. I thought the whole point of this lockdown was to bring them down, but they're going up and continuing to go up. Uh, but the areas where they're really going up, uh, doesn't seem to be much being done about it. Oh, yeah, and of course, um, because, yeah, power, and craziness for stopping the English from certain areas at the border. To be perfectly honest, haven't the police got better things to do, like catching real criminals? I don't see that there's been a lot of issue with English people from lockdown areas coming into Wales. Mainly the other way round. Yeah, I'm looking at you, Abercunnan, or certain people in Abercunnan. Perhaps if we stopped our own people going out, Hmm, politics and power, and let's be different. And let's close the pubs because, well, yeah, we don't really care about them that much. So um, that's my cynical and annoyed look back at the week. Well, very depressing, really. Um, although, Bradley took all keeping me going and um, compost and such like and um, I must stop saying and um, and yeah my face is back bye bye